Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In this very exciting and powerful video of quartic challenges, we are having one very interesting equation today. x minus 2 whole square times x square minus 12 plus 4x square is equal to 0. We have to find out all four solutions of the equation. So let's get started. I will expand with this bracket. So I can write x square times x minus 2 whole square minus 12 times x minus 2 whole square plus 4x square equal to 0. Now I will divide this equation with x minus 2 whole square. So first we have to make sure that it should not be solution of the original equation. So once I will put then 0 minus means 2 minus 2 whole square that is 0 square. So this term will be 0. First term, left hand side you will get 16, right hand side you will get 0. So x not equal to 2 is true. So we can divide by x minus 2 whole square. Let's divide. So each term I will divide with x minus 2 whole square. x minus 2 whole square. Now cancel whatever we can. So first term x minus 2 whole square, this term will be over. Cancel. This term will be over. So what is left? x square minus 12 plus 4x square over x minus 2 whole square. And right hand side is 0. Now I will take this minus 12 to the right. So x square plus 4x square over x minus 2 whole square equal to 12. Now I will make our denominator common. So what I will do? I will multiply with the first term only. I will multiply like this x minus 2 whole square plus 4x square. Now denominator is x minus 2 whole square. And right hand side is 12. Now see, I will expand this x minus 2 whole square. So it will give us x square plus 4 minus 4x. So let us write over there. x square in bracket. x square plus 4 minus 4x. And after that we have 4x square. And denominator was x minus 2 whole square. And right side was 12. Expand this one. So I can write x power 4 plus 4x square minus 4x cube plus 4x square divided by x minus 2 whole square and right hand side is 12. Now you can see 4x square 4x square. I will write x power 4 plus 8x square minus 4x cube divided by x minus 2 whole square and right hand side is unchanged 12. Now from these two terms 8x square and 4x cube I will take 4x square common. See what will happen. If I will take 4x square common with negative sign. So let me write 4x square see what will happen. Then in bracket I will write 2 and see it is I will write x over x minus 2 whole square equal to 12. So I can consider minus also common so that it will be in the same form. So I can write x power 4 minus 4x square times x minus 2 over x minus 2 whole square equal to 12. Now I will split. I will write here itself. I will split our numerator. So there were there are actually two terms. So I will write in this manner x square over x minus 2 whole square. See this is our first term. This term. Now come to the second term. I will write minus x minus 2 and x minus 2 whole square. So let me write once we I will show you I will cancel these two terms. 
over x minus 2 whole square and right hand side is unchanged 12. Now see this term I will cancel. So it will frame one quadratic equation x minus 2 whole square and minus 4 here I will write x square over x minus 2 and minus 12 equal to 0. Now you can see this is one quadratic equation in x square over x minus 2. Okay, so this term I will consider a. So it will become a square minus 4a minus 12 equal to 0. One quadratic equation easily we will use quadratic formula or Shidrachar formula. So let us apply a square minus 4a minus 12 equal to 0. Let's apply Shridharachar formula. So I will write minus b. So 4 plus minus under the root b square. So 16 minus 4ac. So plus 48 and divided by 2a. So I will write 2. 4 plus minus square root 64 over 2. 48 plus 16, 64. Now we know that square root 64 is 8 over 2. 4 plus 8 is 12. 12 over 2 is 6. 4 minus 8 is minus 4. Minus 4 over 2 is minus 2. So we are having two values of A. And remember what was our A. Let me write here. A was x square over x minus 2. Let me write x square over x minus 2. So a equal to 6 and a equal to minus 2. So let's solve one a equal to 6 case. So a equal to 6 that means x square over x minus 2 equal to 6 cross multiply x square is equal to 6x minus 12. Take all the term to LHS x square minus 6x plus 12 equal to 0. Apply Shridharachar formula. Minus b, so 6 plus minus under the root b square minus 4ac over 2a, so 2. So let me write here, it would be square root negative 12. 12 is 2 root 3 and square root of minus 1 is i. So I will write i times 2 root 3 over 2. So from here I am getting 3 plus minus i root 3. This is our complex solution as you can see one pair of complex solution. Now I will consider the second case a equal to 2 negative 2 a equal to negative 2. Let us put the value of a. a was x square over x minus 2 equal to negative 2. Cross multiply x square is equal to minus 2x plus 4. Take all the term to LHS x square plus 2x minus 4 equal to 0. Let's apply Shridharachar formula minus b so minus 2 plus minus square root b square so 4 minus 4ac so plus 16 over 2a so 2. Minus 2 plus minus square root 20 that is 4 times 5 so I will write 2 root 5 over 2. Now I will divide with 2 so I am getting 2 real solutions minus 1 plus minus square root 5. So there are four solutions. Two are real and two are imaginary. Let me write once. x is equal to the complex solution was 3 plus minus i root 3. And second pair of real solution is minus 5 plus minus square root 5. I hope this video will be meaningful to you. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe friends. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care.